Hello. As you will know, our churches are now able to be opened for private prayer and for mass. So on the 2nd of July, we are proud to announce that all our churches are open for private prayer and masses will begin on the 4th of July. So we'd just like to take this opportunity to show you how our churches will look and the new way of uh, coming into church at this time. So, maybe you've decided to come to Holy Trinity. And so in the normal way, you walk up the path, but there's a queue. This isn't normal at Mass, of course, but now we can only let people in one at a time. So you may find a queue outside the church. Please make sure you join the queue by standing two meters away from the person in front of you. There will be stewards inside the porch welcoming people in and they will invite you to enter the church one at a time or one household at a time. So our stewards, who are being represented today by Sister Anne, uh, will be wearing protective personal equipment, or PPE, which you'll be heard, heard many times uh, over the last few months. So they will be wearing an apron and a pair of gloves. They will also have a thermometer. It uh, is an infrared contactless thermometer, and the steward will point it at your head and press the trigger to see how uh, your temperature is. If you are more than 38 degrees Celsius, you'll be asked to go home. Unfortunately, you'll not be able to come into church. Some of our stewards may also wear a mask and visor. Please do not worry about this. They are not sick. It's just that they have decided they want that extra bit of protection. So once you have uh, had your temperature read, you'll be invited to come into the church. Another difference you will find is that the toilets will be closed. This is because it is too dangerous for people to use the same toilet. So if you uh, do need to be in uh, as close to a toilet at all times, please uh, please do stay at home. As you come into the church, you'll find a hand sanitizer station, which can be used with an elbow paddle. So use your elbow to press the trigger and use the hand sanitizer, then enter the church. Our churches are looking very, very different. You will see this tape on the end of the pews. If you see this tape, please do not sit on that pew. You will also find signs on the ground. We have had to implement a one-way system. Please make sure you follow the arrows at all times. When you come to Mass, you will also find these yellow and black signs remember social distancing. When queuing for communion, you will stand on these signs. So no one is less than two metres away from each other. And here in Holy Trinity, only five people can queue for Holy Communion. As the person receives communion, so the people move forward, standing on this sign. You will be invited to come and queue for communion by a mass rep. Do not leave your pew until you're invited to do so. You'll see the sanctuary. We have statues uh, for uh, veneration and the tabernacle with our Lord inside to conduct our prayer. Please do not enter the sanctuary and do not touch the statues. When you find your place to sit, if you are members of the same household, you may sit together on a pew. However, if you are not of the same household, 
you will see these signs sit here. Please only sit on these signs. And so we continue to follow the one-way system. in order to leave the church. So there will be an entrance and an exit. Please make note of this, we, as you may be exiting the church or entering the church through a different door than you normally would. So here at Holy Trinity, you will leave the church through the emergency exit, remembering to use the hand sanitizer as you do. <laughs> and then we leave the church. So thank you for coming to pray with us today. And we look forward to seeing you here at church once again on the 2nd of July and for Mass on the 4th of July. Take care. Stay safe. And God bless.